incredible. Buhari finally agrees the election was rigged, confirms Peter Obi's victory before the court. Hey, my people, now wow. No be smarting. No be smarting at all. You see, this is what we as individual has been lamenting and talking about. President Mohammed Buhari already knows the truth from the one that this election was actually rigged. They are APC APC, isn't you know also. So, at first, he tried to cover up to see if um, the truth will not be revealed. But because of Peter Obi's persistent and consistent, he was forced to reveal the truth. And besides, he is revealing the truth because the case has gotten to the highest level, which is the international courts. Alright? So that is why he is actually confessing this. This is this is unbelievable and in fact <laughs> incredible. Let us check the content my dear listeners. This is evening news. A lot of reactions have trailed a revelation made by the Special Assistant on Digital Communication to President Mohammed Buhari Bashir Ahmed on Saturday morning, confirming that they may have been rigging in last week's presidential election. Bashir Ahmed made the statement via his Twitter account while reacting to the recent allegations of rigging leveled against the independent national electoral commission INEC and the apc by the presidential candidates of the labor party peter obi recall that tinubu had emerged winner of the 2023 election in an electoral process that has sparked a lot of controversies on the competence of the INEC and its officials However, according to Bashar Ahmed, Peter Obi could not have won in Lagos State, but since he insisted there was rigging in the election, it could only be in Anambra where Tinubu won 0%. He said if there had been any rigging or manipulation in last week's presidential election, Peter Obi couldn't have won Tinubu's Lagos. But since they insisted there was rigging, it must be in Obis Anambra, where our candidate, now President elect Bola Tunubu, won 0% in the state. In reaction to this, President Mobari spoke in pain, saying that it was unexpected, but he knows that the election was rigged and it was rigged in favor of Tunubu. You see? You see, this is why I said it that this country, Nigeria, is not, I'm sorry to say, the country is rough. Yes, it's a very rough country because of the kind of people that is ruling the country. Yes. What do you expect me to say? Commend the country? No. I would do no such thing. You understand? Instead, we have to tell the truth the, the way it is. Understand? That's just it. My dear listeners, the best thing for this um, administration to do, for this administration to end well, or if this administration really wants to end well, the best thing for them to do is to carry out a re-election seriously or else it will be like an indelible mark that cannot be cleaned off
Don't forget that the international organization has already given it a very bad mark. Yes, they have already given it a very bad mark. They have already tagged this election to be the worst election ever, ever done in Nigeria. The first ever. The first one was in 1983, and that was Buhari's administration. Now, the second one is in 2023. So, are we supposed to experience something like that again? Of course, no. So, it is better. Something quickly is done to save the situation. Or else, Madam Sabi. All right, my people, um, let's quickly hear from you and let's know what your take and opinion on all that has just been revealed. Maybe don't forget your comments, they are still very much of great importance. Don't forget to leave them below the comment section. Click on the subscription buttons as well as bell buttons to get updated each time we upload any new videos. Thank you.